Hi guys, today is actually an exciting one and I'm really super excited about doing this another amazing video for you. But today, guess what? I'm doing something like of me, like something made of me, something that I've been part of for the past seven years and this is pretty amazing for me to see you guys. So pretty much you actually want to ask what are we looking at today? Definitely we're talking about programming languages and this is pretty awesome. So today we're actually going to be talking about programming language you could actually learn in 2022 that can actually help you in massive skills and start handing well in the tech space. Amazingly, so stick with me as to keep the world rolling and I'll be right back. A programming language is a way for programmers or developers to communicate with computers and this is really amazing to see that a series of set of codes are being used or written, line of codes written in like form of a test and the computer can understand this. Now programming language has been in existence for a long time in the series of first generation of computer, second generation, third generation to fifth generation where we have massive tabs, amazing computers and this is pretty much you could actually want to think about programming in the days of first generation computer where you have a big large computer as full of an environment and you cannot even carry it but look at me holding my portable computer in the fifth generation of computer that makes it awesome and now you see the advancement in technology just by the series of lines of code being written in computer and you might just want to think about how this code thing works and this is simply because you see a compiler is built that actually understands this, this series of codes, this line of code that you actually wrote inside your computer. And that's what makes it awesome. Pretty much in my tech career, I could really say programming can be a bit kind of stressful. I have to tell you, it's actually not been easy because you actually have to understand how this program works, set of rules, you know, bringing it together. You have to think. Sometimes I have to fill some box and I have to tell you, poof. You just want to get tired and maybe like give up you see people sometimes you just do a mix spell in the, in the lines maybe thousands of lines of code hundreds of lines of code and it takes like two weeks trying to you know just maybe mistakenly write a dot where it's not supposed to and uh, you find it difficult to actually really detect it but thanks to amazing compilers nowadays that can actually help you to know what's wrong quickly and maybe resources online and you could actually find to your lines of code and get things done but amazingly, this is really great and I have to tell you, being a programmer, it's not actually easy. Sometimes you actually think, people are saying, oh, stick, you're getting bad. Like, seriously? Yeah, pretty much. But it's actually an exciting journey. If you know it, it actually helps your brain to think fast, to, you know, get things done in a fast manner. You could actually become smarter if you're a programmer. It helps just like people that play chess games and, you know, uh, learn children on chess games and how they become intelligent with that quickly but that's the same thing with programming too if you learn programming you actually tend to be you know smarter with whatever you're doing around you and you could actually improve your skills and ways of thinking quickly amazing so let's dive into it straight up Are you scared no don't be scared guys so this is actually how programming works sometimes when you tend to write codes and your code runs and you're like excited you're like wow maybe three days one week one month you've been trying to solve a problem like a bug in your code and you actually get to work and you're like yes yes sometimes you might actually almost eat your computer sorry guys this computer is expensive i would just treat it away sometimes actually so it's pretty great to actually see exciting stuff like a challenge while you're actually writing programs so today the first one on my list is javascript javascript is actually a programming language but most people classify it as one of a client side scripting language and that's pretty great and javascript is actually very popular you see a lot of applications using javascript today and this is pretty great you could actually see 97.8 percent of websites around we definitely have javascript written on them and that's pretty good 
that's not just about javascript javascript became more popular because it was it's actually easy to actually build a lot of frameworks around javascript and you see most of the highly demanded skills nowadays you have to have javascript yeah, because it's like a core foundation you want to learn css html and javascript so once you learn javascript then you can like learn its frameworks and that's why you see amazing frameworks on javascript and if you want to think about one of the awesome frameworks you want to learn in javascript today you think about learning uh, angular think about learning react it's very popular people want to use react companies are in high demand of react you also want to learn Vue. you also want to learn nextjs ember.js even node.js and amazing stuff that's pretty great so javascript is actually amazing if you're going to tech in 2022 it's very compulsory nobody would they you have to learn javascript to most especially to actually you know uh, you know survive and understand to even help you in other languages while you're building so if you're interested in learning one of the amazing programming language in the tech speaks today javascript is an amazing language for you to dive into and learn it's the language itself and also its frameworks that can actually make you survive and be amazing in the tech space yeah so let's go to number two on my list so guys before we go to number two let's talk about the sponsor of today's video amazingly skillshare skillshare is an online learning platform whereby you can learn a lot of amazing tech skills or even other skills in the tech space creative space or whatever space you are you could learn a lot of amazing things about even programming languages if you want to learn javascript you can go to skillshare you can also go there if you want to learn things around creatives photographies and awesome stuff yeah pretty much great so Amazingly, uh, this is actually exciting because I'm not just, I'm talking about skills you can learn and you have a platform that can provide this for you. And that's why Skillshare is there for you. It is one of my favorite courses because this course is actually a project based course. It's actually amazing. If you're going to learn this course, it's actually created by GeoLM. Uh, it's a web developer, and brilliant store because it's actually amazing. You have to build six web projects with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And that is why this course is actually amazing. And that's why it's one of my favorite. Why are you learning? You're learning to build. And in this uh, course, you're actually learning and you're building stuff. And that's pretty amazing. So you can check it out. Build six web projects with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript by GeoLM. This is amazing. You can so this is the deal, guys. Your first 1,000 people who will click the link in my description or pinned to my comment section will get access to use Skillshare for free for one month and that's really great. So what are you waiting for? Go to the link in my description, click the link and get started today. Yeah, and I can't wait to see the exciting stuff you will build with what you will learn on Skillshare. Yeah, so let's go back to the next one. So guys, welcome back. The second on my list today is actually Python. Relax, guys. It's not a snake. <laughs> yeah, when you hear Python, you're like, scared like, is this a snake? Python is, is actually a general purpose language, amazing language that actually is similar to English. It's just the way it's what makes Python very amazing is because you actually communicate on, almost in English language. It's very easy to learn. And what makes Python so unique is that it works in almost every part of tech space and that is a machine learning hey hi the web programming you want to build or, or even mobile and amazing stuff that's what makes python a, a great so when you think about python stop thinking about this thing is actually a programming language and it's really amazing so uh, python is great because it's simple you can get started learning python is another amazing language to whereby if you have the skills to be in high high demand in the tech space today and you could also get a job quickly so go check python out and learn the amazing programming language Hi guys, you can see my coffee cup, awesome stuff. This time around, we're doing Java. You can actually get the language already. Yeah, amazingly. So if you see a coffee, then think about Java. Java is actually an amazing programming language. I, I would say it's one of the most strongest and used programming language in the world. Java is used by over 5.5 billion devices across the world, which makes it very awesome. And following in, what's excited about Java is that it was initially called Hawk after an Hawk tree and that stood outside Gosling's office. And that was pretty great. And later, the, the project was renamed Green and uh, was finally renamed Java after it was named after a Java coffee and a type of coffee from Indonesia. 
and that's pretty much when you see java you see a coffee and you know programmers then you might actually want to ask why programmers like coffee to take a lot of exciting cup of coffee every time java is actually popular because it's actually you know it's just for different stuff and it's an object oriented program language well standard and you can use it for different platforms exciting stuff you can build on mac on windows on mobile ios whatever you want to build it's really great for java you know that technology is used by more than 6 million developers across the world with running over 5.5 billion devices that's pretty awesome the language is pretty strong i'm telling you yeah so it's actually an awesome language you want to try to check in and nowadays we have new frameworks like spring you know struts and also amazing stuff frameworks using java that it's actually making more stronger and more amazing yeah pretty much i think it's something you actually want to check out you know building amazing applications across different platforms yeah so if you want to if you're a java developer today you definitely be an alt cake and you could actually go check it out so let's move to the next one so guys next on my list is called c sharp <laughs> sometimes when you see the c and the hash you get confused and go like how is this pronounced c sharp <laughs> C Sharp is actually a multi-paradigm object-oriented programming language developed by Microsoft that runs in .NET frameworks. And you see amazingly a lot of, I have a couple of friends that are actually .NET frameworks, pretty great. And you know, uh, it's actually used a lot for building amazing web apps or, or even Android Windows and iOS apps. Pretty much, uh, it's actually, you know, developed and maintained by Microsoft. It's a language language you can actually learn because there's high demand of, you know, C Sharp language across the tech space as well. So feel free to go check out C Sharp if you want to become a developer cool let's move to the next one so guys finally for the list today we have the php <laughs> oh god this is actually amazing it's actually an acronym called hypertest professor and it's actually amazing because it's widely used by a lot of developers across the world you know learning program and doing awesome stuff with whatever doing their computer i you know it does amazing beautiful uh, frameworks like uh, Laravel frameworks that you can actually use and you can even use it for uh, you know uh, amazing uh, apps like uh, you know content management system like WordPress, Drupal and a lot more awesome stuff around PHP. PHP is good, it's great but a lot of developers felt like you know <laughs> it's uh, security, lacks security, strong security and uh, people have a lot of security problems around PHP but trust me, funnily <laughs> Facebook initially built with <laughs> PHP and you know becoming one of the amazing uh, you know most popular social media platform used now you know just foundation of php great stuff so if you if you feel free to check out php if you want to learn it yeah definitely you get a good job as a php developer and all that yeah so that's pretty much everything for today uh you could also also want to check out extra stuff extra language like typescript kotlin language go language and other amazing programming language that you want to learn with talk space but these are the top five programming language that you should try to learn today and you'll be in high demand to get your uh, that cool job easily and become you know amazing software engineer or software developer pretty cool stuff so thanks for sticking around for this video if you have not subscribed for this channel please make sure you hit the subscribe button and comment on this video and like this video <laughs> okay guys please make sure you hit the subscribe button like the video and drop your comment and also come back for other amazing videos and i'll see you in my next video peace